What is up, YouTube? Gonna get here back at it with another historic simulation, career simulation. Historic, eh, but uh, not really because he's still in the league. That's right, we're simulating, re simulating Derrick Rose's career. Before the video starts, make sure to drop a like, drop a comment down below. Uh, who would you like to see next? Either a real life player, I still got a lot to do. And uh, obviously, now that we're doing historic, see what happens in today's NBA or start in the past. I don't know what how we're gonna do these exactly yet, but drop a comment subscribe if you're new you enjoy the content turn on post notifications but let's get right to it Derek Rose obviously you guys know injured after his MVP season it was in the playoffs against Philadelphia they were up by like 10 with like two minutes to go maybe less I don't I don't remember exactly exactly but I remember the play does a little hop step lands and then and, and then you know what happened this is mvp rose in today's nba now guys i know in the last one the kobe bryant sim um i saw a comment it said to start in the past and with the with the roster and, and then use 2k's draft classes that they have which would be you know incredibly accurate but uh i tried doing that with derrick rose I found a roster that I liked, but the rose that was in there already had multiple. It was the current rose. Just they changed his age. They changed uh, his. They changed his attributes, but he still had all these stats, uh, like from all the years uh, besides, I think, Detroit. So I was like, how is that going to work for a sim if I want to check his stuff at the end of it all? If I want to check his accolades at the end of it all, he already had um, a lot of stats. He already had a lot of stats, and I was like, that's kind of whack. It's kind of like he played all those seasons already, and we're just rewinding his age. This, by importing or just making Derrick Rose join this Bulls team, it's 23-year-old actual Derrick Rose, obviously MVP Derrick Rose. So th this was the easier way because I looked at, yeah, I looked at multiple, I looked at multiple created rosters. I liked one of them from like 2010, 2011. It was, it was great, but it, like I said, the Derrick Rose wasn't right. I tried switching out the Derrick Rose using that roster, tried switching this Derrick Rose in with that Derrick Rose, and then I just kept getting errors. I could, it didn't let me like start a season with that roster anymore so i don't know what happened there and then i saw another one but the roster was whack uh chicago gets an mvp just like that if he leaves chicago he leaves chicago i'm not gonna like force him to stay here i'm not gonna make sure we re-sign him uh, no whatever uh, whatever chicago wants to do whatever the bulls want to do it's what's gonna happen but for now the team looks pretty insane if you add an mvp rose a young lowry a young levine a young derrick rose uh Otto porter just to be that maybe three and d type guy and then wendell carter jr the Double, double machine but we're here for derrick rose we're here to see what he can accomplish in a healthy healthy career uh and that's what we're gonna do 31 total badges of course he's an mvp already uh two-time all-star one-time all uh all nba a uh, rookie of the year and first team all rookie so already pretty sick accolades now to see what more he could add to it if he were healthy so let's get to it let's see what he does with this chicago bulls team it's not horrible now that he's on it um but yeah we'll, we're starting at the start of uh 2019 2020 season derrick rose's career we'll see where he ends up we'll see uh, how many all-star games he makes how uh, how he would uh be destroying the league let's see what he does in the first season healthy mvp derrick rose wow they did Wait, what i feel like the bulls might could have done better without derrick rose somehow i don't know why they did so bad what the heck lebron james mvp morant rookie of the year six man yusuf nurkic Kawhi Leonard defensive player most improved bam kenny atkinson coach of the year obviously everybody's healthy right now um because that's injuries are off he does make an all nba second team so it's not his fault i guess he's out here probably balling we'll go look we i mean i don't know why i was looking for our our team in the playoffs we clearly are not gonna make the playoffs he scored less than Levine, but eight assists a game, 1.5 steals, uh, 53% from the field, 37%, 38 pretty much from three. Uh, Zach Levine and Derrick Rose tried their, their hardest, their hardest to do something to get us to the playoffs, and it wasn't enough. Marking in 16 porter 12 a game um i don't i don't know and then like a double double machine like i said wendell carter is it the bench it might be the bench there might not be enough help what well, uh yeah might be not enough help and not enough defense because lowry not the best defender derrick rose not known for his defense zach levine not known for his defense so yeah it might be we might be letting up uh, quite a few points here and there so i mean derrick rose huge season like huge season better than his mvp season 
Raptors win another championship without Kawhi Leonard. Kyle Lowry goes crazy in eight games. Who were they even up against? The Mavericks. Year one uh, of Derek, healthy Derek Rose, MVP Derek Rose, and uh, we'll see how much he improves. He'll probably hit a 99 for sure. We'll see a few seasons of 99 Derek Rose, see if he could get a championship for the Bulls or wherever he ends up going. Like I said, I'm not going to force him to stay here. Nothing but green for the entire team. Rose goes up from a 94 to a 96. And then, okay, that should help. That should help a lot, actually. So, 28-year-old uh, Sadaransky doesn't go up. They drafted Cole Anthony because we still sucked. Um, why do you keep getting point guards? Do you not realize you have an MVP right now that's only 23 years old? I mean, Cole Anthony is going to come off the bench. Sure, he could play some secondary position as well. But what about Kobe White? Y'all just gonna forget about Kobe White like that? At least trade Kobe for a bench piece if they don't and they just let him walk. Y'all are dumb. Thaddeus Young goes up one. What the heck? Nice. Now the Bulls have three point guards. Three point guards off the bench. One small forward. That's gonna work out. That's definitely gonna work out. Derek Rose is a 96 overall. He's not, he's 24 years old. 24 years old. 38 badges. Made an all star team last season. So pretty much just accolades on top of accolades for us. I'm, and I'm hoping a championship. Maybe I get to jump into a finals, a game, uh, a clinching game for the last couple of minutes. Put up some pretty insane numbers considering they're better than his MVP numbers, not his rebounds, but everything else was. But honestly, I'm just, I just want him to bring a ring to Chicago. He's got two more seasons here. Uh, uh, a lot of the guys are on rookie scale contracts still. L Levine is still here for this season and next. So we'll see. We'll see. I don't understand why the team is still doing so bad. 40 and 42. Giannis, MVP, Anthony Edwards, Rookie of the Year. DeMarcus Cousins, Sixth Man of the Year. Kawhi Leonard, Defensive Player. Most Improved goes to Zion. Whoa, okay. What did he, I mean, I mean, his rebounding went up. Cool. Okay. Mike Budenholzer, Coach of the Year. Uh, and we're back to the top. Any All-NBA first team for our guy or All-NBA second. No. D. Rose is not on here. It is the golden era of guards because there's some really, really great ones out here. Missed the playoffs again. How? Obviously sharing a lot of minutes. He's got to not be playing what he was playing last season. He's playing 31.6 because we have 50 point guards on the team. When he should be playing 37, 36, 35 minimum. He still gets 20.6 points a game, 7.5 assists. Uh, he'd be averaging 23 and 8.5 in his per 36. A steal and a half a game. No playoff appearance again, which is kind of shocking to me. An 89 Levine, who's a bucket. A Derrick Rose, who's an MVP. Lowry, a stretch four. Can, I don't know. I don't know. I don't get it. I do not get it. I'm sure I'm hoping he made another all-star. I'm, I'm hoping he doesn't miss an all-star game. He gets another all-star appearance. And um, from, from 2020 and forward, I don't think he's going to miss one until he starts declining. Um, the Hawks win it in the second season. Trey Young, 25 and 7. Amazing shooting numbers. Now, can we please, can we please just get to the playoffs? He goes up to a 98. His three-point shot is improving. His perimeter defense is improving. He's going to be an all-around just all-around superstar. He's going to have a three ball. He's obviously has that mid-range. He's going to have great defense. It's over. It's over. He has to carry us to the playoffs, please. Uh, everybody's still going up. Levine goes up one. Carter goes up two. Lowry goes up three. Cole Anthony goes up five. Jeez. Still obviously going to be sharing time with Cole Anthony, Kobe White, but at least it's only two now, and they didn't sign. Okay, yeah. Not at 40 badges yet, but everything, everything. Oh, a lot on Hall of Fame. There's no way we don't make the playoffs with one of the best players in the game. And a very, very nice supporting cast. Giannis again, MVP. Cade Cunningham, Rookie of the Year. Uh, Montrez Harrell, sixth man for the Raptors. Defensive player Giannis, DeAndre Hunter, most improved. Rick Carlisle, 57 and 25. Finally, 54 and 28. We should have made the playoffs last season, I think. No All-NBA team, but we are the number one team in the Eastern Conference now to see if they make it far. 23 leading score, 8.8 .8 assists, 4.3 rebounds, 1.8 steals a game. He's got to make a defensive team eventually, please. That would be pretty insane. 54, 40%, and 88% from the free throw line. 33 minutes a game, so a little bit more than last season. He's a 99 overall. 90 overall, Zach. Like I said, these guys would go up by the end of the season. He's an 88. Cole Anthony's already an 86. What the heck? Uh, 82, Otto Porter. 87, Wendell. So 
the team stat continues to make an all-star team like i said unfortunately no all nba teams but if he continues to make all-star uh, appearances stacks those uh numbers up he's definitely a hall of famer easily i mean youngest mvp all that all that jazz now to see what happens in this first round they should still have a pretty solid squad wow they just gave up a 3-1 i'm pretty sure atlanta uh won the championship last season trey young is amazing uh but of course he's got to go up against derrick rose now uh we got a better shooting guard demar derozan is nice uh cottons is nice but we have lowry so we'll see what happens there capella versus wendell we're virtually the same um but we're pretty close we're pretty similar teams we'll see okay we four to them now we're up against a chris paul a Chris Paul-led Washington Wizards with Anthony Edwards, Bradley Beal at the three, Rui Hachimura at the four, Thomas Bryant, uh, Wagner, George Hill, Troy Brown, Daniel Hamilton, Ty Jerome. Okay, interesting. I still think, no. All right, listen, I'm happy with that, though. Conference finals after make, not missing the playoffs for two seasons for no reason. At least the second season, we should have made the playoffs, but... We're back on top. We should continue to be on top as long as the team doesn't absolutely explode because there's a lot of players that need to be signed. The champions are the Washington Wizards. Anthony Edwards, are you kidding me, bro? They let D. Rose walk. They let Derrick Rose walk. And they signed Donovan Mitchell instead. Or maybe Derrick Rose said yes to another team right away. And um, that's where he wanted to go. Maybe that's the uh, the other thing. I mean, they have Cole Anthony. They still have a ridiculous team. Levine's not back. Derrick Rose is not back. Now to see where D-Rose went. He has signed with the Boston Celtics. They gave him a contract. Don't know if uh, the Bulls just didn't want him back. They thought they had enough with what they had. I don't know. I don't know why you want to give a 99 overall player a con. I don't, I don't know. Jason, like, he's loyal, too. It said he wanted to come back, but I, whatever. Now it says somewhat loyal. Anyways, he's paired up with Jason Tatum. He's got Jalen Brown here as well. Two years, three years there. Valanciunas, one more year. So they have a squad. They most definitely have a squad. Their bench is not the best, uh, but they're pretty much borderline 80. So I'm cool with it. They got Precious. They got some young pieces. Um, the Bulls were definitely in a better spot, at least I think. But I mean, hopefully uh, this three-man core stays together. Brown, Tatum. D Rose and they cause some havoc in this Eastern Conference in this NBA. Still 38 badges. I don't know if it's gonna improve more after uh more than 38 badges, but he's 26 years old now on the Boston Celtics. We'll see if he stays here for the rest of his career where he ends up, but for now he's here for at least three seasons. Brown, Precious, Jason Tatum, Valanchunas. So three borderline 90 four borderline 90s, I guess, and then Precious a 76 there. So our weak spot. They got Taco Fall at an 80. Romeo's a 79, Grant Williams a 79, Zach Collins a 79. They do run a 10-man rotation. Brad Stevens still here. Probably the best coach D. Rose has played with right now. First year with the Celtics. Here we go. See if he makes another All-NBA team eventually. Maybe a defensive team because his steals are getting close to two a game. So don't know if that's going to continue to improve. Uh, I have given him a couple perimeter defense uh, training camps to improve that. I should probably give him a perimeter shooting as well to just make Derrick Rose an incredible shooter. First season with the celtics i'll see you guys at the end those numbers from derrick rose 29 points a game 11.3 assists five rebounds two steals half a block close to a 50 40 90 oh my gosh another mvp for the man rookie of the year mikey williams kobe white sixth man of the year anthony davis defensive player cole anthony most improved because he's starting now in place of d rose not not a bad replacement there coach of the year brad stevens finished 62 and 20 of course d rose makes an all nba first team for winning mvp again i really want him to make a defensive team but we finished number one again we were number one with the bulls the bulls somehow miss out on the playoffs how i don't know they have a they have a deadly squad how do they miss is it i th i think there's something in the algorithm for 2k that makes them lose. There's no way. Because look at their squad. A 90 overall. A 92 overall. An 89 overall. An 84 overall. An 88 overall. Like, how is that not? How? How? I don't understand. But there you guys. You saw his numbers. You saw how ridiculous D. Rose is playing. Now we need a championship and a finals MVP. And uh, we should be pretty set. Hello? Don't do this, 2K. Cousins scores 33 on our head. 
The Heat are the NBA champions. Uh, that's been like three East teams in a row. The West is struggling out here against these East teams. Amoni Bates destroys in the finals. And can we just get... This is why my teams usually been, end up being way too ridiculous in rebuilds. Because I need to make them ridiculous for me to even uh, to, to, to put it up to chance against the simulation. Rose, even though he's at 99 overall, continues to improve in different areas. His perimeter defense in AA for his three-point shot. His mid-range is probably already at 99. Um, but uh, yeah, he keeps getting better. Even at a 99 overall, I'm probably going to start simulating now until either he gets re-signed or he goes to another team to try to win a championship because that's all my, my boy needs that's all my boy needs he's got two mvps now enough all-star games um but but yeah i just want a championship that's all i want for my guy so i'm gonna simulate until either we're close to getting one we're in the finals or or he changed teams something major like that those two things happen time to simulate get my man get my man a ring back-to-back -back mvps and he's getting better 35 points 12.5 assists either he doesn't have help or what is going on but uh yeah vucevic Carl bear rookie of the year six man vucevic Giannis defensive player most improved theo benjamin walker coach of the year which is our coach now we keep switching coaches for some reason that's gonna simply start simulating and okay no stop stop 2k charlotte uh, do they have some overpowered team? Uh, they got Cade Cunningham, who's going to be ridiculous. Uh, James Wiseman's got to be ridiculous. They have a nice bench. Just get to the finals. D-Rose, D-Rose. These made-up rookies. I know they're real-life players, but made up in the sense that they're created a, raw, they're created a, a draft class. They're ridiculous. They're legitimately ridiculous. The Suns win it. Finally, a Western Conference team plays 40 minutes a game 31 points per game what's gonna happen i mean i'm just gonna simulate until i'm i'm on a different team or i'm in the finals that's when i'll see you guys because he's gonna continue to put up crazy numbers for sure assigned a three-year contract we keep getting knocked out in the second round um he continues to get better in a lot of areas so the man's a monster he's reached 40 badges tatum's a 94 brown's a 91 so they're both still here as well taco fall looks to be the starter of our team Valentin is most likely the backup, um, and our bench is solid enough. It's pretty good. We continue to finish number one. Derrick Rose continues to win uh, MVP awards while putting up absolutely ridiculous numbers. So he's won three MVP awards in a row. Going to be the best point guard to ever play the game and uh, not get a ring. Quick little update. Our boy is 32 years old now. He's still an absolute monster. 42 total badges, 99 overall. I'm guessing after this season, maybe he'll start declining a little bit uh, or a lot of bit. I don't exactly know, but he didn't get as much minutes as he did before. So if you give him 37 or more, he's going to get you an MVP award and put absolutely ridiculous numbers. I mean, that's ridiculous in itself, but you give him a little bit more, he goes off. He goes nuts. He's been winning MVP awards. Obviously, I think that last season was like the season he didn't win. But he won in 2023, 2024, 25, 26, 27. All-star teams, first team All-NBA, second team All-NBA, third team All-NBA. No ring quite yet. I think the furthest, the farthest we made it was uh, the conference finals. The third round, the conference finals. Um, and I got, that was a close series. Maybe I should simulate with SimCast one of these times around. Uh, the team is still nice. It could definitely be better, especially our center, but our bench is decent enough. Uh, I mean, these two guys, yeah, they're not the best, but at the same time, we have some of the best players in the game. Derrick Rose, the best point guard in the game for sure. I mean, one of them. Uh, we still have been consistently finishing number one seed, number two seed, number three seed, nothing below the three seed. It's, it's hard out here. It's hard to just win one ring. All right, guys. It's pretty much over for the hopes of getting a championship. So I'm just going to go out here and score as many points as I can with Derrick Rose for the remainder of the seven minutes. Um, because I want to get some gameplay in here. Even if it's not for the video, it's for me. Just to play with an amazing Derrick Rose. Yes, he's on the Celtics. It's not the Bulls, which kind of sucks. But we're down 3-2. Uh, we were down 3-1. This is the conference finals. Uh, I should probably just player lock on to Derrick Rose and let the other players do their thing. I locked on Derrick Rose. Do I make a comeback? <laughs> I don't think I'll make a comeback. But if my team plays defense, which they won't, um, now it'd be different if I was controlling the entire team. But I just don't want to. It's over. He'll, he, might, he might get lucky. Oh, my gosh. They're double teaming me. Get off me, man. Get off me, man. 
10 points in the second. He only has 19 points. But yeah, we got like uh, 50 guards on the team again. It sucks. And one. And I'm just going to rack up more points for our boy. He's got 20 now. He's going to get 21 easily. Might end up with like 30 or 40 in these final six minutes. It's over. I tried my best. Uh, I got so many more points for Derrick Rose uh, efficiently as well. Uh, a couple of assists too. When they double team me, we got in some easy... Just, just slam it. Easy slam. He's got 37 points right now. Um... He had nine points at the half. Obviously, don't know how many. I don't know how many. Uh, maybe I started at like 16 points, 17 points, something like that to start the fourth. Not good. Not good. But like I said, he's going to finish with 40. The Magic win it. They've been on an absolute tear. They have Luka Doncic. They have Nikola Jokic. They have uh, a squad. They have a squad. Quick update on what our squad is looking like. Jalen Brown is at the three. Uh, Brian Antoine maybe i don't know he's at an 86 overall 29 years old d rose is only 34 so he's probably i mean unless he retires at like 37 which a lot of people do um 37 36 i don't know if he's going to 40 41 we'll see though Jalen brown i think one of them declined a little bit i don't know there's still 90s though obviously we're all in like our our early 30s and then we have this javier batista guy 89 overall center we have dennis which is nice, but he's going to take a lot of minutes away from Derrick Rose. Uh, Alex Stokes. Okay, as long as it's not... Okay, only one point guard off the bench. I'm um, cool with that. Win a championship, please. I don't know if he... Did he resign again? He's got two seasons left with the Celtics. We'll see where he goes after that. I'm guessing he's staying with the Celtics. Back-to-back -back seasons. Our boy declines. I didn't show the first one because he only declined like two, but now he declines five. He's, almost, he's on the cusp of retiring. He's got to be. Um, still made an All-NBA second team. But it's over. It's over unless this team gets a real difference maker. Everybody's old. Nobody's getting younger. Uh, that's just not the way, you know, aging works. Derrick Rose finally retires after 20 seasons. They didn't make the playoffs with a 46 and 36 record. That's how good the East was. Incredible. 39 years old. Uh, just to see some of his statistics, he still finished that season with 16 and 7 assists. 20 and 9, 20 and 9, 24 and 10, 23 and 10, but then he had a few. I mean, these seasons in themselves are absolutely ridiculous, but he had even more ridiculous seasons. 32 and 12, 33 and 12, 35 and 12. He had three absolute monster seasons, and uh, yeah, he ended up being a boss, uh, a Celtic. He ended up being a Celtic for the remainder of his career. They're willing to give him what he wanted, uh, I guess money-wise. Chicago just let him walk. They had two point guards in Cole Anthony and, and I guess Kobe White. Most definitely a Hall of Famer. There's no way he isn't. There he is. The year is 2036. 2019 to 2036. Uh, points per game, 25. Four rebounds, 9.5 assists, 1.6 steals, 0.5 blocks. He's got to finish in some of the top, top, top categories. He finishes third in all-time scoring. Oh, my God. He finished above Giannis, and Giannis played more games. Field goals made. Uh, D. Rose is fifth. D. Rose, even though he doesn't have a real tendency of shooting that many threes, he finishes 25th all-time. Uh, top 10 in free throws made. Oh, my gosh. He finished literally everywhere. And rebounds, I don't think he's going to finish top 100. Assists, he finished right behind John Stockton. It's actually ridiculous that he got kind of close. 400 assists away. Steals, he finishes fourth. Yo, he actually finished in all these characters categories minutes up fifth turnovers second and points per game i never seem to find my player on here i don't know why but he finished like 25 or by there so he would have finished uh 15th 16th somewhere there 17th and then same thing with assists per game he would have finished somewhere in the top 10 maybe right next to chris paul and he has the fourth most played games behind Giannis, lebron Kyrie, and then derrick rose he never got injured if injuries were off in real life. First, we look at his career highs, 58 in points, 22 field goals made, 10 three-pointers, uh, 20 free throws, rebounds, he got 12 in a game, assists, he got 21 in a game, steals eight, blocks five minutes, 55, and now we look at his accolades. Six-time MVP, one time in 2011, and then how many in a row? Uh, five? Five in a row, 16-time All-Star, six-time uh, all first-team All-NBA, three-time second-team All-NBA, two-time uh, third-team All-NBA, Rookie of the Year, and first-team uh, All-Rookie. The fact that he got that many MVPs was surprising to me, but, I mean, those numbers were absolutely ridiculous that he was putting up 
finished in top categories in almost everything. Hall of Famer for sure. Sucks that he couldn't get a championship. He literally made like the finals once. But I'm not here to do that. I'm just here to follow his career. He went from oh, 2019 to 20. What was it? 2019 to 2036. There you guys have it. D Rose. Like always, make sure to drop a like on the video. Drop a comment down below who would you like to see next. If you're new, you enjoy the content. Make sure to subscribe. And as always, guys, thanks for watching.